It's been a while since Illinois basketball has been ranked, but that's exactly where the Illini find themselves today, coming in at 25th in the AP Top 25 poll for the first time since November 22nd when that poll was released. Illinois basketball back in those rankings. No change at the top. Baylor still there. Gonzaga and UCLA both move up. Purdue, the top Big Ten ranked team at number seven, and there's the Illini at 25th. They've won nine out of their last ten games and four straight, and they will head to Nebraska tomorrow looking to win a game where they are heavily favored, 13 and a half point favorites. Head coach Brad Underwood says he's not worried about the rankings, more concerned about his own team and the stats and analytics that go along with it. You start looking at some of these teams and 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 you start looking at who they've played and they're seven and zero against quad fours or whatever and they got these daunting records. I don't care. It, it's all going to play out. If we get ranked, we get ranked. If not, let's just keep flying under the radar and don't let anybody talk about us. Let them talk about all the other guys that are you know they're playing great. We'll be fine. Also today, Illinois junior Kofi Coburn named the Co-Big Ten Player of the Week, sharing the award with Wisconsin's Johnny Davis. Coburn averaged 26 points, 14 rebounds, and two wins for the Orange and Blue last week. He's now fourth nationally in scoring at 22.5 points per game, third in rebounding, averaging 12.5. Here's the matchup for tomorrow. Illinois, 11-3, sits atop the Big Ten with a 4-0 conference record. Nebraska is last in the league, 0-5, yet to win a league game, yet 7:30 on the Big Ten Network. We'll see uh, if they can go take care of business and then move on. We've got a big weekend next weekend, or this weekend, I should say, Michigan on Friday and then Purdue next Monday. Can't wait for those games. Looking forward. All right, Brett, thanks.